folks. How y'all doing today? Uh, make sure to hit that subscribe button, hit that thumbs up, leave a comment below, and share my videos. Every now and then I'm going to have something different. I mean, it's not going to just be shoes. But we got shoes today. These are the Nike Air Zoom Flight, the glove, SLs. As you see, the colorway right here is white, black, with poison green. I will put these numbers in the description so you can possibly find a shoe on different sites. If I can find a version of this shoe in any colorway, I will put it inside the description so that you will be able to look it up on Amazon because I'm going to put an Amazon link on wherever I can find it. Usually I can find some stuff on Amazon and sometimes it's pricey, sometimes it's a deal. So always check my video descriptions on anything that I show you guys. Uh, so, like I said, Nike Air Zooms. These are by um, the Gary Payton's editions. Well, yeah. Collabo with Nike because he was on, you know, he was with Nike at one point in time. I don't know if he still is. I would assume he's still getting checks from them. Should be. Okay. These are the Nike Air Zoom GPSX. I'm calling GPs. Gary Payton. Gary Payton said that his um, hardest po opponent to defend was um, John Stockton. I saw that in an interview a couple months ago. But um, they called him the glove because he used to lock people up. Defense, the glove. But here they go. I have never worn these. They do look good. They're pretty fresh. Only issue. I got the wrong size. So you got a, either a 10 or a 10 and a half. I mean, a 10 and a half or 11. These kind of fit a little snug on my foot. My feet are getting a little wider. So I didn't take that into consideration. Especially since they're, they zip. And, they, you know, there's not really any room at all once the shoe is zipped up like this. I'm not see if you see me unzipping them. We have the Nike check on the zipper. Shoe looks great. Here go that poison green on the inside. I'm gonna pull one shoe down for you. So you have to get a look. But as you can see the inside of the shoe. Here's one side, you can see how okay. You see flight right there. I wish you could take this whole thing off. They have, I may put some of the other um, shoes that Gary Payton has in the description. So for links for them because they do have it where this is off. Where this, the zipper or the glove part is off. Which is still, you know, real, still a nice shoe. Even without this on there. But I do like this on there. But he got the white mesh. And the mesh, white mesh on the side with the green little flame type things or poison, whatever it's supposed to be. Got the green on the inside. By the shoestrings. Nike. Doesn't say anything at the bottom of the shoe. Really, well, well it says Zoom Air. It says Zoom Air at the bottom of the shoe. But I mean, as far as like, you know, it doesn't say Gary Payton on it. But all in all, this is a very nice shoe. Like I said, myself, I'll have to get a bigger size, so I will be getting rid of these. Unfortunately, that's the one that just happened. Just sitting in the closet. Oh, does say the glove on the back? So this should have been on the box. This should have said the glove on the box as well. But hey, it doesn't. Would have been nice. Some of us keep our boxes. I do. But... As you know, or probably assume by now, the wrinkles, or not necessarily wrinkles, the things, yeah, I'm gonna call them wrinkles, inside the material right here. And you can see those are the flames, or whatever you wanna call that. So the shoe's not messed up, it's just how it is, because it has the stuff under it. 
one thing good about these shoes though if you wear them in the rain the rain should fall right on off and i would assume that cleanup you know like getting little pieces of dirt on here wouldn't really stay unless it's at the bottom of the shoe this shouldn't keep dirt really i don't think i don't think it would unless you really really um because it's like a leatherish material they just start putting material in the boxes that would be nice here's the bottom of the shoes I have no idea what type of material that is. So this looks like a, like they wanted to do, to do like the carbon fiber on the Jordan 11s, but they did not. But it, is, it looks similar to that like design. It's, it is hard though. Got plastic on top of a design. I mean, yeah. There's a design under here, a little pattern. Let's see if I can show you guys that. Little pattern. If y'all can see that pattern, Nike checks on the side. But yeah, Jerry Payton's. If you get opportunity to get a pair, I mean, they look great. If I had, you know, the right size, I would have kept these. I really like these shoes. Like I said. I'm going to put some links in the, in the description. Make sure to comment below. Let me know if you have them. If yours fit, you know, true to size on you, let us know. Um, you know, I say that my foot is getting wider. It's changing and getting a little older. So, I don't know if it's just me or everybody's, you know, if everybody um, foot doesn't fit the same way in this shoe. If they need to have a size um, bigger like me. Like some shoes I do, some shoes I don't. It depends on, you know, not just the brands, it's also just it's the shoes. Different shoes, I need different sizes, no matter what brand it is. Um, so, yeah, if you need a size up in these, let us know. Somebody may have them, and, you know, leave, leave your shoe size. You, if you want these, if you want anything that's um, in any video, the video that I posted, Always put it down below so somebody see it. You may be able to get a sale. So, hey, I don't care if anybody can get some little love at the bottom of the comments. You know, get a little sale. It's all good. But uh, you guys make sure to like. I mean, hit that thumbs up. Uh, share the video. Leave a comment below. Hit. Thanks.